Junk Car Willie here, guys, at the 42nd Annual Mopar Nationals outside of Columbus High and Hebron High. And look, at I like different. You guys know I like different. And we got this beautiful 1980 Murata 426 wedge. And uh, we're going to talk to the owner here in just a second. But I want to get you a look at it so you guys know what you're talk we're talking about. I like different, man. I, I had an 80 or 81. This is an 80. I, mine was black and uh, actually black inside, I'm thinking. Drove it through some flood waters. They ain't good on them. Where are you out of, sir? Western New York State. Can I sit there? Yeah, sure. Western where? Western New York State. Oh, okay. South of Buffalo, right on the Pennsylvania line. And how, what, you want to say your name, first name, if you want to? Mike Haney. Mike Haney. And you've owned this how long? 43 years. That means you bought new. I bought it. Or almost. It was uh, six months old when I got it. How many miles did I have on it? Uh, it had not many. It, okay. I can't remember. That Probably was 43 years ago. Uh, I asked you about your a girl he'd remember, wasn't I? A pretty blonde girl he'd remember the date and the time he met her and everything. I asked huh? you about the per first pig he ever fucked. <laughs> <laughs> I better not do that. <laughs> now you got me. Had she to squealed on me. Now you, <laughs> <laughs> now you don't got to uh, have anything. How long did you drive it as a car and before you did all a this? A couple months before I started on it. I started off with a 360. Uh -huh. You know, put a 360 in it and uh, ran that with everything else it had, the 904 and the eight and a quarter. But then I got it in March, and then that winter I stripped it out, took all the air conditioning garbage out of it, stripped the chrome trim off it, got rid of the stripes on it, put an eight and three quarter, 727, and uh, worked up the 360 a little bit. And how long did you have that? Uh, that was in there from 81, early 81 until uh, 1987 when I put now, a 440 on it. Did you play around on the street or did you take I it to the street? That's a street car, yes. Okay. Uh, well, I didn't, you know, I street, 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 yeah. I didn't know if you'd take uh, So that's when you put the 440 in. I put the 440 in in 1987. How long did that last you before you got to this big boy in it? That that 440 was in there until 2019. Okay, so this is a recent build. Yeah, this was from 2019. Wow. I got that engine started Memorial Day 2019. You, you did pretty good in your time. Yeah. Man, I love it that you brought it here, drove it. You got the old school wheels on it, man. I just, yeah. like I said, you just don't see them, but now, you know, with that, that front end like it is, man, it's really custom. You know, if you like a if somebody don't know about cars that like the Monte Carlo SS, they'd like that, you know, the front end or a Lagoon, you know, yeah. it's got that. Everybody likes them cars because the front end, and it's got, you know, it's got one of them kind of stock, cool front ends. Yeah, I, I like, yeah. I guess. Yep. I, I've had people mistake it for a Monte Carlo before. Yeah. One lady told me it was a Monte Carlo. She said, it looks just like one. I said, no, it looks just exactly like a Dodge Murata. Yeah. She says, no, it doesn't. It looks like a Monte Carlo. Her husband said, let's go. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Leave a man's car, woman, and dog alone, right? And cat. With me, yeah, yes. cat. We're animals. Let's put it that way. Hey, yes, I appreciate sir. it. Thanks for your time, sir. It's been not, such a good caregiver. Not a problem. Yeah. Have a good day. Man, we're just going to take one more walk around this. You need to know any engine facts? or? Yeah, I'd like to know it all. I just usually let the person talk. I'd like to know it all. Uh, I just sometimes I don't want to bug somebody more. You ain't bugging me none. That's why I'm here for. Okay. I yeah. Like tell me about the engine. Tell me about. It's a 572 cubic inch world block, uh, stage five heads, tunnel ram, poly EFI, 750 horsepower with no power adders, uh, torque flight, good billet torque flight. A Lupo torque converter, Dana 60 ass in, 373 gears, runs 10, 10 and a quarter mile. Streetcar, 93 octane. Wow. Some pump. You got a name for yourself up there on the street then, don't you? Pretty much so. <laughs> well, well, he's had it all this we long. Used to I do mean, it, you know. Yeah. Back when we used yeah. to do it, it, it was, even with the 360 with nitrous on it, it was pretty scary. 
you know, I didn't have many people that come out on top of yeah. that way. In fact, I never got beat on the street. Well, you that. surprise them with that. You know what I mean? They're thinking, yeah. oh, it's a grandma's car. Well, they think car. it's a 318 with a two barrel yeah, and a yeah. air cleaner turned yeah, upside yeah. down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's a little bit more than the air cleaner. You did a little bit more to take the air cleaner and turn it upside down. Yep. Check it out. And I love it that he loves it. You know what I mean? You can really get off on somebody's passion, and he still has a passion for this car. Uh, you know, I've never met so many people that's owned their car since new or close to it than here, man. I've got a few stories like that. And I... A lot of them don't even have it on a sign. I just asked, so that's pretty cool. As always, guys, it'd be a boring world if we was all the same. Keep being you.